ladies ready to fall in love all over again. Well, he's back better than ever, nominated in the Jazz Vocal Album of the Year for 2014 for the Junos, the one, the only, Matt Dusk. Wow. Wow, such lies. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. But no, it's I not know, a I lie. Know, it's that. not a lie. You know, Matt, my funny Valentine, yeah. the Chet Baker story, I interviewed you and I think it was just about to come out. Yeah. It wow. was, I think it was back in December of 2012, and look, right. here we are. I know. It's crazy. I'm very excited. I'm excited to talk about it. It's a great and record. Michael Bublé is not nominated here in your we category. Go. I, I, there's a chance. There's a chance. Yes, it's going to yes, happen. Yes, it will. It will. It will. And I mean, you've done so much in the last few years. I mean, it's been in Vegas, and with this album here is a, a testament, I think, to you, Matt, and what you're really about? Well, I mean, uh, for this record, I really want to go back to my roots. Yeah. Um, you know, as a, as a singer, I love to sing so many different types of music, mm -hmm. uh, from pop music to, to jazz, but I really wanted to focus on why I got into music. And um, Chet Baker was one of those guys when I was in my, you know, teenage years would put on a record and listen to um, his stuff when I was on a date because he plays very romantic music and you know track one would lead to two and then by third or fourth track I would be lost in other things and I wanted to create a record that captured that romantic mood but at the same time would bring people uh, back to who inspired me one of the people which is Chet Baker because he's a great great musician. Okay so the big question is uh, mm -hmm. when they say your God. name thanks I know What's going to happen? Uh, you know, I have no idea. Actually, I do not have a speech. I, I don't have anything prepared. I mean, the one thing about this record I have to say is uh, the musicians on it and from, from going from the, the pre-pro all the way to, to finishing the album, as a producer, you get to see how everyone puts their, real, their, their hearts and their souls into the music. And I remember after we had finished recording with the orchestra, I'm sitting at home going, Okay, don't screw this up. Because, <laughs> because it's so beautiful. They did yeah. such a great job. And I think I would thank, have to thank all the musicians for putting all their time and effort into it. Well, we thank you, Matt, for a beautiful album. Fingers crossed. Our Go Junos coverage continues right here on Channel 9.